All right, before we start working on the car, we're gonna do a small cleanup up here because it's a lot of mess and I'm gonna get this clean so I can work a little bit more comfortable. <laughs> Today we're gonna install the, uh, we're gonna install the, uh, what's it called? The rear bumper and the, uh, the spoiler. That's what we're gonna do. Oh! And also, we're gonna install the, uh, we're gonna install the, um, uh, what's it called? The tail light. JDM tail lights. You already know those, right? That's a thing that a 300, C, a black 300 CX cannot miss it. So, I'm really lucky to have a really good friend that he's letting me pull a lot of stuff out of the, uh, a lot of stuff out of his car because uh, probably he don't need it. I don't know. Uh, I think he's just too cool. And um, yep, we're gonna install the tail light on it. But uh, before we're gonna do a small clean up in here. First of all, I gotta take all the, the stuff that I have in here because all the bolts, I just put them out and throw them in the back of the trunk. So, bolts and nuts, it's bolts everywhere and I have to find them. <laughs> I know, I'm a little messy sometimes. It's okay, I'll be all right. It is what it is, tear brake light, $100 right there. 100 bucks, 100 bucks right there. I'm so excited because we're gonna change this thing also. So, new tail light, new bumper, new spoiler, a lot of good stuff. And that will be pretty much. I don't know, but I always say this is gonna be the last time that I'm gonna work on this car. But always, 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 there, there is always something else coming out. Always. For me, it's a little hard to finish or uh, leave it like like that. For me, always, like, I always find something to do with this car, so I just cannot stop. Hopefully, I will every time. Will. Hopefully I will eventually, so that way, uh, that way I can start working on the on the silver seat finally, and I hope. Thank you guys for been watching, and uh, hopefully you guys have enjoyed the channel so far. Because like I say, I'm still learning how to speak English, so I apologize for that. Working hard on it. It's not that easy. It is not easy for me, especially because all my people around me speak Spanish. And that's good. Okay guys, before we uh, put the bumper and the, the spoiler, let me do the uh, headlights, I mean, the, let me do the taillights first, so that way we're just gonna have everything going on like how it should be. Uh, and right. There is uh, probably a few stuff that you have to remove up here. You have to remove all the covers, the plastic covers that is in there. And then, gonna be some connectors 
And then it's gonna be some connectors, some bolts, some nuts that you have to remove. It's not a big deal. I don't think it's a big deal. Hopefully it won't. Once you remove the bolts on the back right here, you gotta be so careful and that is start pushing it back. Make sure you don't break it. Because that thing is like very strong. They stick really hard to the uh, to the car. There we go. Oh, this is only one connector that they have right here. And that's it pretty much. Yep. That's it. That's one right there. Let's clean this up a little bit. That is not letting me push all the way in. Oh, here it is. This thing right here was. That was a problem. There was a little nuts in here. Now. Should be good now. Yeah, a lot better now. Way much better. And then you're just gonna put the bolts in the back. You just gotta put the nuts in the back. And then you just gotta put the nuts, the nuts back in and plug it in. It should be good. It's not that easy. it's not that difficult actually. That was good, that's a good that's a good thing. We don't want to find out more difficult stuff in this car. That looks good. Looks amazing. That's my favorite word. Looks amazing. Thank you guys for the support. Thank you guys for the support to the channel. I really appreciate that. I just met a guy today, uh, I just met a new friend today, just met a guy today, he's uh, in the car wash, I was washing the car and he's a uh, deep closer, and then he came, and he came to the car and he was wondering what kind of car was it, and there is a lot of people that still don't know what kind of car this is, because they're a little, they're pretty rare, but this year, it's been like pumping out a lot of 300ZX owners and all that, which is good. The, uh, and now, the value, the value, the price, this car is getting really priceless almost. Because the price on this car, they like, is getting high every year, every month basically. Every month there's somebody posting a car. Every month there's somebody posting a car for sale at 300 300 CA for sale, the price is like crazy. You still can find like a good one for 35, 35, 4,000 $4, dollars, but with no turbos. And they, the turbo edition, twin turbo, they're like really expensive now. Very, very expensive. And I'm still chasing them. I gotta get the, the silver one done soon. And it's time to drift fry it. I already have my coach. Dave is gonna be my coach.
Okay, we already got the tail lights installed. And uh, now we are gonna install the rear bumper, which we came for. I really like to record videos in here because it's a lot, it's like really quiet in here and I don't have any issue with the audio. Uh, this is a really good thing. Because out there when I place where I live, the place that I'm living on, the place where I'm at is uh, we have the highway, we have the airport, we have the street just right there. It's like a main street. And uh, all the time it's a lot, very loud. So every time I try to record a video up there, it's like too much noise on the video. And I don't like that. Ooh, check this out. We should put it, we should have dropped this car like this. We should have dropped it more, I guess. <laughs> Looks good. Crazy. Really low. But no, that's not my style. That is not my style. Okay, before I install the uh, the bumper, I have to remove this license plate out of here. Okay, it's time to put the bumper back. It's time to put the bumper back. Where it belongs. Oh. It's gonna be a little bit difficult. I'm by myself. Yes, sir! <laughs> yes. Yes, it looks really good. Let's get in there. It looks really good. Damn. Damn, boy. Especially with the headlights. Ooh. Wow! 
Look at that. I just cannot believe it. Damn. That's exciting. Put <laughs> myself on. Put myself on. Oh my god, this is totally different, something else, it looks really good. <laughs> I'm glad I'm sharing this with you guys. I'm so excited. Oh my god. This is totally different something else. It looks really good. <laughs> I'm glad I'm sharing this with you guys. I'm so exciting. Damn, this thing looks good now. It looks really good. Yes. It looks really good. What do you guys think? Damn. I hope you guys have uh, I hope you guys are exci exciting as I do. Because I'm so happy to see this car in one quarter. Oh, there it is. Do you see the spoiler? How I fix it? It's not. It's not glued it yet. Still gotta glue it. But I just wanna mount it. So there is the spot where I fix it. I could do better. I know, but I just wanna do it like that. So now you already know how to fix your spoiler. So that way you're not gonna be buying. But check this out. Damn. It looks good. Really good. I am more excited on this car than the 370Z. <laughs> yeah. Damn. Oh my god. Okay, that's how this is gonna look. And uh, but right now I have to go home and I'm probably gonna finish at home. I also had to buy the glue for the spoiler so I have to go see what kind of glue is gonna be good for it. All right, catch you guys later. I'll catch you guys on the moment. I catch you guys on the. Okay, guys. It's already up. Uh, it's a little late right now, but I still wanna put the. I still wanna install the the spoiler, so. I'm gonna do that right now and hopefully it will be ready for tomorrow. I was trying to find something like to glue it, but uh, it was a little hard for me to find. But I don't know if there is a way to do it with glue. I'm just gonna use a double tie double, double tape. So that way. I'm not gonna mess it up the hatch with glue and all that shit. And also, it's about to start raining right now. And that is not good. But first of all, I got it cleaned up a little bit. I got it cleaned up a little bit, the, uh, the spoiler, because it still has a little bit uh, you still have some uh, double side tape from the last time that they installed So I definitely have to remove all that
Okay, that was the worst part, so I had to put something heavy on top of that. <laughs> so we're gonna let it see that thing right there, so that way the spoiler is not gonna pop off. And let's make sure it's gonna be like flat. Because at first it was like a wobby, but we don't want that. It looks really good. It looks beautiful. Finally, finally. I got it, the whole car in one color. It's, except for the door frames and all that. But it's something like, I don't worry about that thing. Oh God, yeah. It feels so good to finish something. Just for now, but this thing is not done yet. I still gotta do a lot of stuff. But we are one step closer to the, to the end of this build. All right, that's how I mount the. Uh, that's how we install the the spoiler. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I don't know. There is nothing fun about this, but the result that is a good part. The way it looks, that is the greatest thing. Yeah, I really like how it looks. So clean, so perfect. That looks just perfect for me. Thank you guys for watching and uh, that, that will be it for now. Tomorrow I'm probably gonna start with, probably tomorrow if I get a chance I'm gonna stop the wheel so that way this weekend we're gonna finish this thing or at least get it ready with the wheels. Uh, next thing I'm gonna do is gonna be coil over again. I don't know when that's gonna be. I don't know when that's gonna be because money talks. But uh, one thing I'm gonna for sure I'm gonna do is uh, the door train. Because if that thing fails, I'm screwed up. That's it. If that one of these jacks fell on the windshield, I'm done.